Hey, 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 beautiful people. It's Anika here, just checking in. I wanted to share my Spectrum Noir markers with you. So I'm coloring in this image by La La Land Crafts, and this is a Marcy stamp, Dr. Marcy. Right now you see me coloring in Marcy's face with TN7. And I will then highlight the face with TN8. I love La La Land. Uh, stamps. I think they're so beautiful and I think you get a lot for your money with the size of the stamp. It's a really large stamp. So again, I'm going around the stamp with TN8 and I'm blending it out with the TN7. And she just, she's just adorable. So now I'm feathering it out. Um, and again, blending in that TN7 and 8, making sure it looks pretty good. Then going to dot the her neck with the TN8 and then go over it with the TN7, blend it in. Her hands, I start off by highlighting it with the TN8 and then again, blending that as well with the TN7. Um, touching it up a little bit. And I'll go down to her that right there was a blender pen. I had got a little bit of the brown on her clothes. So I'm highlighting her coat with the, uh, what is that, BG1 and BG2. So I start off with the BG2 and then I work my way by blending it all together with the TN, I'm sorry, BG1. So I start off with BG2 and then blend it all together with the BG1 light strokes. Um, sometimes if the image is really small or tight together, I will kind of dot the image with a darker color and um, feather out as much as I possibly can with the lighter color. So that's what you see me doing here. Really light strokes with the Spectrum Noir markers because again, they're very juicy or moist. They give you a lot of color. So get a lot. Now her dress, I uh, use colors BT1 and BT2. I also use the same colors on her socks. So once again, starting off with the BT2 and blending out with the BT1. Her, getting, I'm writing the colors down. So now the shoes are PL1 and PL2. So I start off again with the P, L2 and then blend in with the PL1. And her, uh, I think that's a stethoscope. I started off with the BGR1 and then I highlighted it with the BGR3. And what else? Her hair bow, I used. BT4 and BT, no, 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 I'm sorry. I used BG1 and BG2, the same colors that I used in her dress. And her um, headgear is a BG2, BG, no, no, Jeez, can I get it together? <laughs> sorry, PL1 and PL2, cleaning it up. And then the centerpiece I use, this is, I guess her hair. So I start off with her hair using EB8, EB7 and EB5. Yeah, I used three colors and then I just blended it all together. The head scope, I used the truest black or true black, I think it's called. That's what I'm lining it with right now. And then I um, went in the middle with a BG2, BG4, and BG6. The panda, I'm using BT4, BT5. And for the eyes, you'll see that I use PL1. Just make sure, making sure you blend all those in together. It's really cute. Love this stamp. So I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial. And I hope you will join me in the next video where you see me actually use this image and put it on a card. So stay tuned, and once again, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.